Hi, I'm Grace Roberts from Westside Middle School. And this is my poem, Bubble. I was born with a bubble, a translucent spherical rainbow about the size of a softball. When I was a baby, my bubble was empty, pure and innocent. Its purpose was to hold memories till you look back on. As I grew older, it changed, inflated to about the size of a basketball and got a weird yellow tint to it after the fights with friends, with one saying, this supposed god of yours never helped me with a response of, being by is disgusting. A woman should never kiss another woman from another friend. It swelled to about the size of an exercise ball and was lime green, from the self-inflicted cuts on my friend's arms and the group emails asking how should I kill myself with me being the only one to respond right away. Last year you two had a suicide pact. On the outside of my bubble I can only see the YouTube videos I watch to try and make myself happy. Like watching a goat pull a human with his tongue or the more obscure video where Jack Septicai merges with Shrek to make Jack Shrek to guy. <laughs> but <laughs> when I took took a closer look, the memories of Disneyland where my grandma would go on any ride my little two-year-old brother could go on. And the trips to Mount Rushmore with my family seemed to be fading. I take a closer look to make sure they weren't pressing my face up against my moss green bubble. I started to sink in like it was quicksand. It engulfed me. <clears throat> I was seeing the world in a different way, a more depressing way. It felt like I was swimming in corn syrup. I finally just reached out my hand and burst the bubble. Unhappiness everywhere. On the walls, the rusty red liquid dripped down like molasses. On my shoes, cementing them to the floor. My hands feeling like wet bread. My mouth tasting like black licorice. My friends, my family. It smelled like skunk with a mixture of loss of friends. Affecting everyone I touched and there is no way to stop it. No, there is. I'm the controller of my life. Life sucks sometimes. You just gotta roll with it. I will chip my feet out of the cement, wash my hands with soap and water, wash the walls, and buy some air freshener. 